Hi everybody, it's Miss Whitney, and it's time to do some art. Today, we're learning about Tiffany lamps. Tiffany lamps were a popular design in the 1890s and early 1900s. These lamps were done in a style known as Art Nouveau. Art Nouveau is known for its decorative lines and detailed designs. Tiffany lamps were created by the Tiffany Company and were best known for their stained glass shades and heavy lead bases. Lead is a really special kind of metal. Today, you're going to get to make your own Tiffany lamp right at home, but you don't need stained glass. All you need is a little bit of cardboard and construction paper. Are you ready to get started? For this activity, you'll need the following materials. Some glue stick, scissors, construction paper or paper you've colored yourself, markers, crayons, or colored pencils, and some cardboard that you have laying around at home. It's also recommended that you use the Tiffany lamp template that we've included in this blog post. You can find it at sdcdm.org. Let's get started. Your first step is to trace around your Tiffany lamp template and then cut it out. If you want, you can try to design your own Tiffany lamp, but be sure to include the lines that are included on the Tiffany lamp template that cut through the middle of each part of the lamp. This is going to be really important later because you'll get to make your lamp stand up by using these lines. Now that you've got your templates cut out, the next step is to color all the sides of your cutouts black. You can use a marker, a crayon, or a colored pencil. Now that all of the sides of your cutouts are colored black, you'll need to use that construction paper or the colored paper that you've created yourself. You'll cut out different geometric shapes. This is going to be your stained glass. You can make circles, triangles, squares, whatever shapes you want to include. Now that you've got all of your shapes cut out, you just need to glue them onto the shades of your lamp. You can decide to do them into a pattern or just a unique abstract design. The final step in your Tiffany lamp is to slide the two pieces together so that they'll stand up on their own. This will make it 3D or three-dimensional. Now you have your very own Art Nouveau Tiffany lamp. Where are you gonna set it up in your house? It should be able to stand right on its own. 